remote doesn't begin to describe it. Indonesia's Papua region, easternmost in the archipelago of islands that stretch from South China to Australia. It's known as the last corner on Earth. Tanggu is the Indonesian word for resilient. But Tanggu means something else now. Opportunity. Beneath Bintuni Bay lie over 14.4 trillion cubic feet of proven natural gas reserves. It is here that KBR and its partners JGC and PTJGC Indonesia are building a clean, efficient LNG plant that will supply low emission energy for decades. The story of Tanggu, remote, resilient, is a remarkable journey. KBR's journey to Tanggu began in Jakarta the bustling, non-stop capital city so symbolic of Indonesia's vibrant economy. The partnership KJP set up a dedicated project office here, relocating the project management team and hiring 450 Indonesian engineers, designers and specialists to execute the design. BP challenged the team to design a hyper-efficient facility that would have the least amount of impact on this remote environment. And the team responded. 1,500 cost-saving ideas became 165 optimization points, equaling $100 million in cost savings over the life of the project. All in all, a solid engineering platform for reliable, clean operations with an eye toward future expansion. Even so, the journey was only beginning. This was basically the beach, and we used to come in here on Zodiac craft. You have to wait for a high tide and come down the coast in a small boat. Not only was there nothing here when we started, there was nothing even in the region. So everything came in by ship. So there was no food, no housing, no water, no uh, sewer facilities. E everything here to support the task force and 9,000 people had to be built from the ground up. Bintuni Bay is the world's largest remaining contiguous mangrove forest. We had to get special permits in order to enable us to cut a few of the mangroves. We were allowed to cut less than 10 acres of mangrove forest. And in the end, I think we cut less than half of that. To get a really good safety performance on a project, what you truly need is a safety culture. We've got about 550 to 600 villagers from the local villages who literally had no exposure to modern life prior to this project, plus another, oh, maybe 2,700 regional Papuan laborers. We had to do a lot of training. We had to do a lot of awareness training. We always tried to build an identity with the Tangu LNG project rather than having an identity with your own company because we've got the whole gamut of nationalities here and then we've got a dozen different companies involved too. Tangu. The journey continues. A best-in-class project that is among the world's most efficient LNG plants. A dazzling safety record, born of training and a unique project culture. 
Respect for a delicate ecological and cultural environment. A partnership that shows the power of working together. Setting the standard for LNG plants of the future here in the last corner on Earth.